I'm seeing fields. Yep, I'm seeing bales. This looks a lot like uh, around my house. Oh, it does? In midsummer. <laughs> yeah. Definitely got a vibe of like three reserves, haven't it? It's got Parque Fernando, Savannah, and now Hirschfeld, and now I've seen those fields. Yep. Those purple flowers are Parque Fernando, a thousand percent. One hundred percent. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> you changed your character. No. Why does he look so chiseled? What's going on? Yours does too. <laughs> you right. don't have derpy eye anymore. What's going on? I have no idea, dude. We're in a new dimension. Things have changed. All right. I don't know where to like. Where's the outpost? And stuff? Have we got to like claim an outpost first before we jump in this? Have we ever done this before? Have we ever played Call of the Wild before? Oh, it is. It's the lookout tower, isn't it? That's where it is. Okay. Is there actually things like this in Spain slash Portugal? I don't actually know specifically where this is supposed to be. So I'm going to say Spain for now. And then everybody's going to correct well, me and I say it's Portugal. Well, I already read you where we were specific, specifically at. We're Granja, uh, Ribeneira. Stop saying Granja. <laughs> you ready? All right. All right yep. Let's survey. Three, two, one. I can see you on the top. I've disappeared, though. I can see you on the top. I disappeared, though. Oh, do you know what? I don't have turned on the music. I'm so no, unprofessional. I... <laughs> Hold hey, on. You didn't miss much. It wasn't as beautiful music as others. It was more like uh, just uh, some violins in the background. I was going, Ooh. I'll, I'll, here, I'll reenact it. You you pan and okay. ready. Hold on. Hold on. Ooh. Wait, keep going. <laughs> oh, come on, let's go. See, that's what, it was. what are we doing? Got a brand new museum. We're messing around. So what I'm going to be doing, I think, uh, over the course of this weekend is gathering information <gasps> on these animals so I can update the spreadsheet come uh, launch day. Oh, yeah, the, the spreadsheet's going to be out of whack now, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Dude, I've got, I, I hear a European hair. Do we want to get the outpost first, or should I smack the European hair? Smack the European hair. I want to see oh, what, dude, it, what sound it the makes hell out when it. a European hair gets hit. I want to see what it sounds like if it sounds different. Because I, I think ouch in Spanish is ocho, maybe? Whoa! Whoa, what was that? <laughs> what was what? Ooh! What was this? What'd you get? Stop it! I'm getting out of the field. <laughs> what is that noise? I hate what that. Are it's what a, are you picking up? It's a bug. Oh, I'm not getting that. Wait, wait, stand in the field long enough and something's flying around my head. Wait, that's not in real life, is it? Hold on. Oh, no, he's definitely in the game. Oh, I heard it. You did? It's a fly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly that. He's just like right in your ear. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, there's something. Oh, I see it. something. Yeah, yeah. That one? Yep, dump it. Did I kill it? No, I missed it. The game's bugged. The game's bugged. Oh my what? god, it's so fast! Oh! <laughs> Dago, Dago, we've lost our edge. We need, to, we need to get that killer instinct back. Hold on, as soon as it stops, he's dead. Making rabbit soup. Stop! Told you it'd be dead. You don't get away. You don't get two chances. Well, you don't get three chances. I shot at it with a 300. <laughs> I should have just been able to hit near it, and the shrapnel from the ground should have took it out. <laughs> <laughs> We are playing on like uh, an experimental branch right now, or an early early release branch. So we don't have all our like setups and stuff and weapons. So I'm... yeah, yeah. What was that? Oh, that was a wolf. I was just about to say that it sounded like a wolf. Did you Listen. hear it? Nice. Oh, dude, it sounds so different than the ones on Yukon. It must be ambient. Because oh, because you can't it. hear it. Yeah. Oh. Okay, that sounds. That one sounded a little bit similar, but the first one, it sounded like a long, drawn-out moan. Oh, I like oh, that. Okay. Another bunny. Oh, yeah, take it. Take it. Oh, yeah, you uh, <laughs> sent that one back in time. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Exploded. I definitely blasted this thing back in time. Where'd it go? Oh, there it oh, is. All right, I found mine. I, uh, I <laughs> hit him in the leg. Oh, I hit her in the leg. 5.27 kilos. Uh, level two, five, seven, three. Let's have a look at this thing. Oh, it's got really long arms. Yeah, it does. Creepy. Ew. 
Spanish rabbits are scary. Yeah, they're gross. Oh, there you go. Look at the flags. They fixed them. Mm, no, they did not. <laughs> <laughs> no, they did not. It's a totally different flag. More color. Or different oh, colors. Wait, shh, listen. Wow. Sounds like medieval music. It does. It feels very, uh, um, Milady. Milady. Oh. You know what? People call me Milady Taco. You know that? <laughs> Who calls you that? People? <laughs> Everybody? <laughs> Come on, look inside. Oh. <laughs> oh, look, there's a spirit. Someone's been here. Oh, there's spirits everywhere. I hate that. That's really going to bother my OCD. Is that messing me up? Is that messing with your brain right now? The fact of where those two cans are. You're getting minus points for that. Why is there cans everywhere? Yeah. What is this crap? Look. Right? What a clutter. What a clutter. Oh, look at this. What are they doing up there? <laughs> Where's the refrigerator? Oh, look at this bathroom. That is the biggest toilet I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> you can't, you're standing up at it. You'd be urinating wait. on the side of it. <laughs> wait, wait, stand there. <laughs> You'd be urinating on the front of it. It's too tall. <laughs> you have to stand on your tiptoes. It's like being a kid again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, a little bit, maybe a bit of scaling the issues is there. Huge too. <laughs> I was just gonna say the bath is this massive. Is the land of the giants. <laughs> <laughs> is is everyone in Spain just massive? <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's get a look at that bad boy. Which one do you have? The lightning. Ooh. The lightning. Yeah, yeah. Okay, it's really glossy. I didn't think it. I thought it was like dulled out. It's actually really shiny though. Yeah, yeah. Yours. Yeah, it's a lot more shiny in the in hand, isn't it? Or shinier. It's. Do you know what that's got actually vibes of? The 270 a little bit? I don't know what it is about it. I think it's just that top part. What is this business? Uh, Potatoes? Potatoes, yeah. I was going to say they look like potato leaf. And just the rows. The, the elevated rows look like a potato field. That's so, it. I'm going to say something now. When I first watched the stream from the devs, when they did the first reveal, the first actual gameplay footage... When they were talking about these different fields, like wherever this one is, I mean, we don't know if it's potatoes, we're just saying that. When you see the, the sunflowers, obviously they have the seeds, and certain animals do pick at them. And then I believe there's, like, different fields with olives, or olive trees, I think they said. I thought there was going to be, like, some new mechanic. Like, on the Yukon, there's different weather changes and stuff. When it snows, obviously it covers the floor. That was something completely different, something unique to the game. I thought with this... They were going to make it so the animals came into these fields and started, you know, picking at the food. Well, come here. Uh, I'm not seeing a need zone here, dude. Okay. What well, do you see? This trampled, like, uh, vegetation here? The, the, on the oh, ground? yeah. It's, like, it's flat? Yeah, yeah. Can you see yeah, the path yeah, that I, I've I, walked? Like, it's, yeah, it's squashed all down? Yeah, I didn't do this, but there's a need zone here for road deer. And this was already trampled down when I walked up to it. So, yeah, I think, it, you know, they did. There is interaction with uh, vegetation. And look at, we're just destroying the heck out of this. <laughs> uh, what I thought we would see was the animals actually coming in to pick at the flowers or pick at the um, plants, sorry. I think that'd uh -huh. be a nice new mechanic to have in the game. Something basically which acts like a, a natural bait system, you know? Oh, road deer there, right there. Right, I'm going to test out the 6.5. Okay. I'm going down, road deer. Oh, that sounds amazing. That did sound good. That sounds like good. I like it. Oh, oh! I don't know. Oh, dude. It's got a I'm torn beat. now. I don't know what I like most. The 30 art 6 or this. I, I'll, I'll be interested to see with the... Uh, um, well, integrity holds. Because so I'd love to be able to use both. I'd love to replace the 7mm with this. Because <gasps> the problem with the 7mm, 7mm is one shot, right? I'd love to be able to use this instead. People have been farming on this land since long before records were kept. With the natural abundance of wildlife, there was little need for cattle. But a variety of grains were farmed here. And the shepherds and goat herds were here long before the Romans arrived. Oh, are they going to like say some stuff about the uh, the Roman Empire? That'd be cool. That would be neat. See some... Uh, see something Roman. to do with that? Yeah, like... Yeah, um, yeah, yeah. I've forgotten the name of it now, but... <sighs> Testudo? I think it's called, you know, the uh, the shield formation. Testudo, is it? Is it called that? God, I'm so rusty on my uh, my history. Kind of fits with the lake down there. What does? Oh, Testudo. yeah. 
I don't know if I'm going to keep that in the video. Basically, <laughs> for everybody at home, when you get the reserve, or if you see the map at any point during this video, Taco was giggling at a lake. I bet you can't find out which one it was and why. Hey, now we'll walk on like the big boulders and stuff. Do that picturesque like stance where the head's up high. Oh, that's right. They, um, they said in the stream that if you're really lucky while you're kind of around these hills, these rocks that you can find, let me see if I can spot one, like one over there. You've got random rocks and things like this. The Ibex will actually stand on top of them. So you can, you, you've got a chance of finding them stood on top of them. Oh, I found one. It's a BC Ibex. What is that? I don't even know what I just said. But it's a, a, a Beseat Ibex, I think it's called. What would you say for that? I would say BC. Or bay seat. Bay seat? I don't know. I, that's well, well, that's absolutely right. Spani there's Spanish <laughs> name, right? It'd be because uh, E is A. Sounds like A. Oh, is it? Yeah. I thought you said you didn't speak Spanish. Well, I do a little bit. <laughs> A E O U is your vowels. A burro sabe más que tú. I'm going to crack one of these things. I want to take one down. Oh, Tango thing. down. Dude, I think that was a heart shot as well. I think my first Ibex was a heart shot. Did I freak him out? Crap, they're running off. It's all right. Catch up. Oh, I'm never going to get bored of the, the sound of this rifle. Sounds good. It's like the 30 out 6. I love the sound of it. The 22, love the sound of it. The newer rifles, I'm very happy with the what they've done with them. God, they are thick, these things, aren't they? Look at them. Yeah. Holy like crap. Our, like I said, they're like my goats. They have the real wide bellies. Have a look at his face. Look at that bright orange eyeball. Look at the fur, though. Look at that, that fur texture. looks pretty cool. Now, I want you to think of the, the animal that I'm thinking of when I say this. Female. 57.13 kilograms. Fur type is common. Difficulty 3. Trophy type is horns. Trophy rating of 49.7. 100 on quick kill, 100 on integrity, 40 on consecutive. Score of 813 gold. 813 gold on a female, huh? That wasn't a heart shot either. That was a lung and a um, a thoracic shot. So I got the spine. Nice. Gems buck? It's like a, yeah, that's what I was about to say. It's like a, a gems buck then because you have the... You can get the high level ladies high. on the gems buck. Yeah, yeah. So what is it we're supposed to be looking for, though? Do we actually see them climbing the mountain or no? Because I kind of want to... I have no idea, but because I've seen mount... Or, you know, I've seen goats standing on sheer edges before, you know? It's like, how the heck did it get there? That's what I want to see. I want to see it, like, on this edge here, just walking well, we've, we've got tracks here, so they might be. Hold on, let me, uh... Like, because there's little platforms and stuff. Oh, this is actually quite a big lake around this area. I don't know how that would work in the game, though. Like, in, in a real-world sense or real life... Obviously, we know how that works, because those mountain goats, they, they defy logic. <laughs> they can right. literally stand on something that's vertical. But, like, in a game sense, I don't know how that would work. What is it that, that they're going to stand on? Because there's, like, little outcrops and stuff. Mm -hmm. But if they can stand on, like, anchor themselves to the... Oh! Taco, look! They can! And that's a male! Oh, yep. You see him? Yep, I see <laughs> I see it. Oh, that's so cool to see that, though. I'm so glad they've done that and not just put it, like, on this thing oh, here. Going on the other side of the hill. Oh, he's doing a typical oh. mountain goat thing where he's just like, yep, you see me, now you don't. <laughs> I'm gone. I'm out. Is there another one up higher? There's more up top. There's more up higher. Oh, yeah, see? The oh. oh, dude, that one's even bigger. Yep. Gotta stop moving. All right, I'm taking. Oh, you got him. You nailed him. Oh, wait. He laid down. No, he oh, stood back up. He, there he's he down. No, he was trying to get back up. He tried, he tried to yeah. walk. He tried to come back from the dead. Left lung. Wait. That's with the polymer tip. So. Wait, say the score. Oh, no, that was a soft tip. That was a soft tip. What's that? 755, did you say? 755, yep. Wait, what? Uh, it's a true, it is a true rack system. There is a true rack system. Oh, there is? Okay, there yep. you go. That explains it then. Because this is the first just... true rack horn system, isn't it? Yep. 
there's just three categories. So your home length, your overall spread, which I'm assuming is tip to tip. Okay. Either that or the farthest spread if they happen to curl back in. Uh, and then circumference. So I'm guessing that's just, it says 27. So I'm assuming it takes the biggest one maybe or circumference. I don't, or maybe you'd add them together. I it's a know. shame that the actual horns fall into the floor like the antlers do. It's, it'd be nice to be able to do what, I mean, we've said it a million times. Like you can do on classic where you can man manipulate the animal for a, po a photograph yeah definitely yeah go ahead get it tango down oh i got another one i have another one glitching out here that's uh, appearing and disappearing yeah oh yeah oh this is common so these beige looking ones they're just they're just the common ones I went really? through left lung, liver, and stomach, but I mean, yeah, that's that's just normal, common the the, the beige ones. Okay, that's good to know. So I guess just keep your eye open then for like different fur types, because there's going to be a few that might just be common. Oh, dude, it's so vast. It's a vast land, say it. I'm getting like Band of Brothers theme tune in my head there with that. That's that was weird. It's nice though. I like the music. Okay, yeah, this hill is massive. <laughs> This is um, Mordor de Dona Emilia. Mordor? Yeah, Mordor. What? This this hill's called Mordor. <laughs> All right, so I would say Mirador. It's Mordor. Mo Mordor. How about we say it with the... the oh, look at you putting anime. a little flip. Mordor. <laughs> <laughs> Mordor. <laughs> it's like the the, uh, the Spanish ver version of the Livio Saw. <laughs> it's Mordor. <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh my Huge. god, that oh, thing is that. massive, isn't it? It is. Uh, anyway, male, 104.94, common fur type, tracking distance of 29.23, easy, 192.4, 0%, 100%, 80%, 669. Oh, look at this. Look how fancy this one is. It's got like a whole window and everything. Does it look out over the... Over Mordor. Vast land. Yeah, Mordor. Like, if you just look down there, if I brought the video in here like this, this would absolutely trick people into thinking this is Savannah. Maybe not like the Tarmac Road, but I hope everybody right. at home knows what I mean by that. Let me know in the comments if you do. You see what I'm saying, Taco? Like, if you look just down there, that, that lake, and then the yep. hill with yep. the color of it. It does, with the trees, the shape of the trees and everything. It's definitely, it looks, there's some similarities. There's loads of them on the side of the hill, look. That's a Ronda Ibex or Ibex. You see them? Oh, yeah, people. Oh, yeah, yeah. Those are definitely different, aren't they? Oh, yeah, definitely. 100%. Oh, look, that one's actually got a nice one. Ronda. Is that how you would say it? Ronda? Ronda, R Ronda. Ibex? Ronda Ibex? So these ones, they looked like they had, like, thicker horns. They looked like they curled back more. The, uh, the first one, yep. the besieged one, or the, whatever it, whatever it was you could call them, the besite, besite or whatever they were, they, uh, they kind of went out to the sides like a, a mo motorcycle handlebars. This one kind of kills. Oh, there's one. Oh, no, yeah, they're all here, yeah. Yeah, these, these ones kind of curl back. Yeah, yeah. Not so wide. Is there no big ones? Oh, there's a kind of big one there. There's Oh, that's a four. Nice. Right, if, if we get a shot on that guy, let's not... I mean, I'm not worried about the placement. I just want to get a look at it. Did I miss? What? That missed! Come on, game. That hit. Sounds oh! Like there's one I think I've just seen him jump! Oh, there's a bunch of them running down. Oh, he's down. He's down. We got him. That one's a gray color there. Smack it, Taco. I shooting over? Don't know, but I've got... I hear I hear one close. I think it's. Why is that one not oh, going down? There. Oh yeah, there's one there. There's one right there on the hill. You see it? Yep. Nice shot. It's down. It's down. It's down. Tango down. Tango is it's kicking. down. It's kicking. It, it's still back up. <laughs> no, they do. They try and fight death. Okay, I think I prefer this one over the last one. The last one looked like it adds. Like a wider, like Taco said, a wider spread. 
But this one actually looks really nice. Let's have a look. Male, 62.65 kilograms common. 405, 861. Look at that, though. You know what? I wonder what they're going to do with the, these long-armed hairs. If they're going to do, like, some sort of true arm system for them. <laughs> so, like, one arm will be longer than the other. <laughs> you know you've got a really high level one. Oh, I see them. I'm marking them now. Yep. Uh, these little dudes go up to three. That one's a white. Oh no, that's never mind. They, they, they do look that way though, don't they? When you see them from far away. Yep. I had it the other day on Layton where I thought I had a uh, a really nice white rabbit. Can I smack that one in the middle? Are you cool with that? Yeah, uh, hit it. Thank you. Right. Uh, what are we looking at? So we're looking at a hundred meters out. Let's bring up the Vasquez. Hundred meters and. Tango down! Tango down! Tango down! You shot mine after I shot it. <laughs> oh, did I? I didn't know you yeah. shot. Sorry, my bad. <laughs> I didn't know you shot. It's all right. You know what? I'm actually quite surprised that we haven't heard yet. As I say that, the, the wolves make a noise over that way towards the west. So hopefully that's a good sign. Any red yeah. deer? You're right. We haven't, have we? Okay, so the Vasquez does not hold integrity. I'm disgusted. Yeah, I figured it wouldn't. <laughs> I wanted it to hold integrity. I wanted it to go around. That's a, that's a, that's a big round. Oh! That's a big round. What did we just say we didn't see? And look what I've just found. Red deer. Look at that red deer. A mythical red deer. Look at that. Do you want to smack it? Look at those roots. What have you got? Uh, I have the, the new weapon. Oh, okay. So you can test it. You, integrity. Do you know what? You know, because I'm such a good friend, you can have that right. mythical red dead, dude. You go for it. It's all yours. You're so sweet to me. Right. You're so sweet I'm to such me. a good where's, friend. Uh, where's, you're such a good friend. I'm looking at you telling you that. Dude, such smack the red dead. It's getting close. I don't see it. Mark it for me. You see it to your left? Yep. Yep. I see it. That's a side shot right there. Uh, I have trees in my way. Always oh, fleeing. What? I'm just gonna crack this guy with this one now. Yep. Yeah, test it out. Yeah. Weapon. Right, I hit him. He's going down. Oh, here's some weird stutter. Taco. What? Diamond red deer across the lake. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> What's the distance on that? Uh, 300 and plus. Alright, 50. I heard it. Oh, actually, this this thing smacked it pretty good. 50, Did 75. It? Uh, actually, no, it's carrying. No, it's definitely carrying. It, yeah, 25 to 50. I mean, it, it hit it hard, but just not hard enough yet. It's down, but not hard enough to, to drop any. I mean, I don't know. Again, let me have a look at the shot, because if I hit scapula... That, that reduced the uh, penetration on the animal, so... Here we go. I don't know what a scapula is. Spatula, sorry. Um, I think we have two diamonds over here. Really? Two nines? Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay. there's, yeah, I think there's two of them. Right, so... It does hold integrity. But I got 46% quick kill with a spatula hit. 235 from there. Once I get to about 199... Probably 195 just to play it safe to catch both sides of the far side of the that herd. Yeah, yeah, I see him. I've got a shot on oh, him yeah. as well. All right, got it. Take it. Uh, you got on. it. Hold on, I don't know what range that is. That's me marking him, by the way. Yep. Right. Uh, I'm. If you have a shot on him, go for right. it, dude. Like, if you've got a clear line of sight, go for him. Yeah, I have. I, I have a bush in the way. I can see you highlighting them, and that's it. Yeah, I, uh, he's, he's like quartered angle for me now. If he turns to the side, he's, he's mine. Going for him. There's the other one. I saw the other one run off, too. Uh, I didn't see where he went. He's down, though. Tango down, so I think you're good. Do you say there was a second, though, in the area? Yeah, yeah. About another 180, 190. But uh, off to the east, but I saw it run through after it fired. I saw a big rack run through, okay. at least. I think it was 
the other one. All right, so here he is. That is a gold. <laughs> it's a troll. It was a troll. <laughs> yeah. uh, all that. Go figure. I mean, so what is? I've, I've totally forgotten the weight on red deer now. It's been so long since I've got a diamond red deer. Two three two. What is it? Two three two. Oh, two three two. Yeah. So the weight yep. on this guy was two two nine. Level nine legendary. Yeah. So it's a uh, it's a little troll. Yeah, troll. Right, I mean, so that, but that's good to know, though, because at least we know we've got rid of the troll now. So we, yeah. I can double back, and uh, we can do our best to get that other one in. We did stick around there for a while. Um, we both know that there's another potential nine over there, which hopefully might won't be a troll, but we can always come back for it. We know where this area is. We do want to see more of that yeah. the map has to offer, so. And that one's yours as well, Tago. That one, uh... If we do come across it again, that one's yours, because I got the other one, so. Okay, cool. Oh, we got some... What, what, what was that? Wolf! <gasps> Chase it down! Oh, Tackle, I'm running with the wolves! <laughs> oh, this is so cool! Look at this! <laughs> oh, that's so cool! I nearly bumped into one. They seem like they're a lot sleeker than the, uh, the ones on the Yukon. They are. They're more streamlined, aren't they? They're skinnier. Oh, come on, ATV! There they are. There they are. I'm not losing them. Right, I'm going to stay on the road, and they're rolling up to the south, so hopefully I can cut them off. Oh, yeah. No, they're going across the road. Are they? Okay. Dude, they're so fast! Oh, wait, 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 wait. Tago, on me! Coming. They growling at you? Nope, but he might be in a second. Oh, Hit. Oh, he's... Ooh, that's broken. <laughs> oh, yeah, he's broken. Come on, doggy, go down. Go down. There we go. Go on. Do it! There you go. Wolf down. Oof. Tango down. Tango down. Nice. Let's have a look. Get right in on that face. Oh yeah, these guys are definitely different than the Yukon ones. Look at him. Coming up right now. I don't know if I... <laughs> he looks a little bit weird. Like, he looks like the... Um... I can't remember the name of the, the actual dog. A breed. It's a specific mm -hmm. breed. It's got like a oh, really... Got some, they're, they're circling. They're circling. Oh, they're coming in? Coming in hot? Yep. You hear them? Oh, I hear them. They're panting. Fire away. It's taking shots at this point. Get down, wolves. You okay? Yeah. Oh, he's growling. He's growling at me, Tago. Behind you, dude. Oh, I need ammo. Ah. Oh, there we go. Oh, no. This one's down. Hit me. Go down, wolf. Stay down. Come on. There you go. He's down. Oh, nice. that was cool. Dude. I got attacked by wolves. Right, so. Oh, yeah, no. These definitely look different. <laughs> <laughs> they do. They do. They do they, like at first, I thought they looked a little bit derpy, but no, I like them. I like the look of them. They got a thicker coat. It looks like too. The whole facial structure is just completely different in the Yukon. I'm glad they, of it they too. They like a mane, a mane to them, like the, the the hair or the fur around them, around the face and stuff. It's cool. Oh, that was a gold eight four seven level seven. Nice. Oh, brain shot him. No, uh. we don't. We don't take brain shots. Scratch that one. Scratch this one was that. both of us. We, we both hit this. We hit it. I hit it twice, then you hit it twice. <laughs> we started off with the uh, Besieged Ibex. I don't know the name of him, so I'm just going to call him that. You guys at home know we're only joking when we say stuff like that. Or, or I'm only joking when I say stuff like that. It's the uh, Besiete? Besiete. Besiete. What Taco That's said. Ibex. Besiete. That's what I say. That's how I say it. Yeah. And then what was the second one that we saw? The, the Ronda Ibex? The Ronda, yeah. And then we saw, I saw a tracks of a, one of those sheep, which we'll definitely be able to catch up with. And we've just run into some wolves, not to mention 
<laughs> the troll diamond that we had. And there's still another one over there. So a lot happening on day one of Quattro Kalinas. You guys enjoyed this episode. Make sure you smash the like button. Let us know you're enjoying it. Subscribe if you're new. And we'll see you all. I'm going to try and catch you off guard today again. In the next one. Ha, 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 ha.